there is there's been a bit of a problem with our kiln. Uh, and oh, I think it's been yellow ash. It's missing at all. It uh, comes on at 76. It went to 80. It's had at 80 for a quarter of an hour, and then goes uh, one. There are one. Looking that up in the book, it says that either the elements are broken or I think it was a relay defective I'm being that it's brand new and uh, it's going to be down to scut to sort it out so a bit of a disappointment after all that but we're going to have to wait now until the new year and see what they're going to do about it So we've investigated what our error one message was and with help from warm glass we were very quick to respond um, and hit the nail straight on the head so I guess with scut it's a bit of a design feature problem it was the kiln lid switch um, not making contact so it's in that little hole there and if you listen you'll hear the click there so that was preventing the electricity going up to the elements it's a safety feature so our lid was coming down hitting the thing and not going all the way down to hit the switch so to rectify it quite simple you just need to We'll remove two screws. We're going to put these on the floor. Remove the two screws, hinge it back. I probably should say the most important thing is to make sure it's unplugged. Do not, under any circumstances, work on this with it in the wall. You don't want power on. Okay, so once we're opened up, we can see the switch up here. Okay. And all it was was this arm was bent. And you just have to get in and give it a bend quite simple something that I would have thought really needs taking care of but what you're listening for is the click stick it back on Probably not going to be able to do this without actually using two hands. No, hold on. Okay, just need the two hands to align it properly. Do them up again. And then we can check that when the switch comes down, you can hear the click before it shuts. And that's it. And that solved our Hero 1 message. So that's all it took. So we fired the kiln up and I'll show you what the result was. Kiln has had its first firing and has come back down to 62 degrees, so it's safe to open. So this is our first unveiling of <coughs> the coasters that we had already put in before doing our repair. So here goes. Ooh. 
Seems all right, can't see anything cracked. I love the little blobs. Lots of little blobs we use later. <laughs> and my yellow's gone orange. Mm, Striker glass. Oh, sneaky. All right, let's get it out. Have a better yeah. look. <laughs> 